Hey, what's up? Not much, I'm just winning my new digital citizenship project. You want to work on it? Sure. Today we will show you on how being a digital citizen can change people's lives worldwide. Since we're all growing with this new updated technology, we need to learn how to use it safely and what it means to be a digital citizen. So digital citizenship covers many different categories. Let's take a look what being a digital citizen means. Hey, want to see what I researched? Sure. In 2015, we all have this new updated technology that includes Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. This means that we have access to all these social worlds and we see that others post, comment, and view. But some comments are not showcased to being respectful of digital citizen. Comments can turn off as rude, abusive, and in general aggressive. Though together we can stop this. Together all of us can stop these cyber bullies and be a digital citizen. So what's other comments can be considered cyber bullying? Things like, hey, someone just called me stupid online. Well, that's not very nice. I'll we'll just ignore it, I guess. Hey, did you call me stupid? No, it was not me. I saw you. I saw you call me stupid. I can see your name. Hey, it really doesn't matter. Just ignore it. Well, it kind of hurt my feelings. I'm sorry if I hurt your feelings. I didn't mean to hurt them, but I would love to come along with you guys. I'm sure Carl's okay with it. You're probably just playing. Make sure you don't do it again. That's not what a digital citizen does. Mm. Carl. Sorry. Hi, I'm Carl C. I'm Carl R. I'm Zaria. And we're students from this 4th, 6th grade class. And we're going to have a picture. 